Hello dear viewer, welcome to Teamfight Tactics on iOS with me, Jelenon. One thing that may be immediately obvious, you can change the size of the screen. Clearly designed for phones, but uh, yeah, you can play it on a tablet. You just have to expand the screen to make it feel more comfy. There are missions in Teamfight Tactics. You get stuff out of it. You can make friends, which I have not. Notifications, etc. They finally introduced the Team Planner. So, this should be helpful. <laughs> I did not have this before, and I am very much a noob to Teamfight Tactics. I watched a couple videos when it was coming out, like Disguised Toast with his Volibear build, and stuff like that. Uh, I've played a couple games in the past, even before this Team Planner patch. I found Pirates to be amazing, and the Rebel thing as well was pretty good. So I think we'll probably go for something like that. Blade Masters are pretty fun. Yasuo you can get. Yeah. I remember when Yasuo cost five. Before all this space skin stuff. Yeah, the Star Guardian stuff doesn't seem to work terribly well, I've found. At least not for me. I clearly don't know how to use it yet. Uh, but yeah, so Rebels, Pirates, and stuff like that seems to be pretty good. Because you get money for being space pirates. You get blasters can be good. Rebels, etc. But honestly, it also seems that uh, the items are a huge deal in Teamfight Tactics. And I'm just frankly not that familiar with them. Uh, let's see, that's Lulu. Gangplank is good. Misfortune's also good. I think they both count as mercenaries. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yep. Um, Aurelian's soul is interesting because he just does his own thing. Goes around the whole map as a spaceship. It's pretty fun. He just releases little fighter pilots from his carrier ship bay kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. These are the League of Legends heroes, if you don't know. I assume a lot of people know about League of Legends, so yeah. Uh, not going to worry too much about stuff. Well, yeah, I wonder, you know what, just to try to get an idea. Let's see, Twisted Fate is not a pirate. Zaya is not a pirate. The cyborg thing, I don't really know how to pull off well either. Uh, Poppy is just good because she's very tanky. So she can be great to have on your team. Hmm... Kha'Zix is Void, and he jumps to the back line as an assassin infiltrator type. Zed. Lucian is a blaster. What's this one again? Cybernetic, that's it. Yeah. Hmm. I gain health and attack damage. Oh yeah, I've never really been able to pull that off well. Shin is interesting because he is, I want to say... Chrono, and Chrono seems really good as well. Uh, Yasuo. Darius is a pirate. Hilarious enough, yes. Uh, Ari is really good, but she's not what I'm going for. Nocturne, nope. Sin Chao. I don't know how to pronounce that. But it's a name. I'm trying to remember, he's a protector of Yangard? Protector. Yeah, that's right. And then he's also Celestial, which is Lifesteal. Which seems interesting, but not as good as Chrono. Weirdly enough. Mordekaiser. I'm trying to remember. You are Darkstar. Okay. Which I also have not been able to pull off yet, but I haven't played that many of the games yet. Blitzcrank is Cybernetic and a Brawler. That's right. So he can be a good guy to start off with, just to get some extra health and tankiness. Mm. Where, oh where, are my other pirates? Karma. Ezreal is good because he's Chrono and a blaster. Which means we'd get the blaster and the pirate and the Chrono. Okay, if we took shit. Uh, v is a cybernetic brawler. Nico is a star guardian. Shaco is a dark star infiltrator. Cassidin, celestial something or other. Master Yi, there we go. 
He's a Blade Master. So we'd have three Blade Masters with that cop. Main, Ash, Jace. There we go. He's also a pirate, I want to say. And then we'd have two Vanguards. Interesting. Okay. That's if we took Poppy. Yeah. And then there are ways to actually expand the team size. I believe you can get 10 people. Or 11. I think you can get 11 if you get the two spatulas together. After you've reached level 10. So. Let's see. Jin is a good sniper. And he's a dark star, I want to say. Right? Yeah. Jinx is a rebel blaster, on the other hand. So that would work very well. And then, of course, we'd want Misfortune and Gangplank. If we can get them. Alright. So, I wonder how that goes through. Also, ooh, Pinku Feather Knight for two bucks. So you have your little avatar dude. There's my avatar dude. It's the river sprite. Our little legends. I have nothing else unlocked. There are arena skins. I'm going to turn up the volume a bit. Okay. So you can spend money on the game, but you can just play for free as well. All right. Let's accept that match. Yeah, matchmaking has always been pretty fast in this game, so that's fun. Okay. I don't know how the team planner is going to affect things inside the game yet, but yeah. The game is decent about telling you when you've got something that you can upgrade, um, but once you've already got a stack of three, it isn't very good about telling you, oh hey, you can continue to get this guy to three stars if you buy more of them. So you gotta kind of know what the champions look like, and I don't, because they change the skins and everything. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, we'll just try our best. I'm not expecting to be the winner. I think I've only won one game, and that was with the Pirates build. So that's one reason why I'm drawn to it. <laughs> because gold! Shiny, shiny gold. And then, yeah. I'm trying to remember, I think refreshing costs two gold. Leveling up is four or five gold. I think it's four gold, but you get five XP out of it. So there are some differences from other auto chess games. And other than that... I would say items are a heavy, heavy influence on the game. You really want to get the items that will let your attackers deal a lot of damage quickly, and that seems to be pretty key. Uh, the tanky items are nice, but they don't seem nearly as game-defining, as far as I can tell. Like, I had a three-star poppy before, uh, I want to say Sin Shao, some other Celestials protectors and stuff. I think I tried to go Star Guardian that game as well. And then we just got destroyed by the end because even though we had some good tanky items that would like revive my guys, just didn't do enough compared to their little sniper in the back just constantly dealing out the damage. <laughs> and being protected because I didn't have any infiltrators to jump at them. So yeah. yeah. And one good trick that people did when I played in the past, was uh, protecting your backline with a tank. Because you know that people are jumping at you and stuff. Yep, yep. So, you live, you learn. Apparently, somebody's internet is slow. Probably mine. Yeah, it looks like I'm the slow one today. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Alright. Hmm. Well, we got a number of players with some cool little legends, so that's good. It's always fun to see that. Yeah, one thing I don't like as much about this game is how you do need to control your little legend to go pick stuff up instead of just getting it. So, like, all your little extra gold and stuff. The items. It's a throw. There you go. Hmm. I would say if anybody is trying to get deeper into this game, uh, learn how the items combine just kind of by heart, and you'll probably do a lot better than I will. Because, yeah, I kind of have to hover around and check, okay, what does this become? And who would be best to have this and stuff? But yeah. yeah. We're just going to try. 
going to try and see what we can do. I have no idea. There we go. All right. Ooh, there's a Graves immediately. I want it. And he's got a little mana gem on him. Uh, that's less good, I think, for Graves to have. But yeah, here we go. I want that Graves. Okay, this is kind of your freebie hero. We can even sell him, and then we have the mana gem in our inventory. But I like Graves, so I'd rather keep him around. He's kind of like a weird tanky pirate, but not. Smoke grenade. And yeah, that just gives us plus mana to activate our ultimate faster. That special event. Alright then. And then my little legend will go over here. It should be a new character. Yeah. And it's Master Yi. One of the guys I was looking for. And Graves just said, like shooting fish in a barrel. Okay. Uh, Twisted Fate is a Chrono Sorcerer. We could go for that. Battlecast Brawler. No idea what that is. Uh, let's take Twisted Fate for now. But Master Yi. I think Master Yi costs three. I'm not sure. Now, we still have a money. It wouldn't hurt us to just buy something. Honestly, getting her makes sense. Because we had multiples of her anyway. I'm taking Twisted Fate because he's a Chrono. And Sorcerer isn't bad either. But yeah, if I can afford her at the end of this combat, I might pick her up. Kog'Maw, Battlecast, what do you do? Battlecast Chance deal magic damage. Interesting. My road to conquest. Mm -hmm. So there's another Rebel, and another Rebel. So Malphite's a good tank. Uh, and we could put Sigs out here. Heck, we could even do that, and we'd have our Rebel bonus. And Rebels gain a shield and bonus damage for each adjacent Rebel. So that's why it's pretty good. Uh, we could get rid of something. I think for now we're happy. Ooh, another champion, and two items. Nice. So Bloodthirster, that's not terrible. Uh, there's another rebel there, another graves. Could go for Zaya. She's not bad. And of course, if I did have ten money or more, then that could stack. Uh, what if I put this on graves? Ooh. Have more spell power. Spear of Shojin. That would be pretty good as well. Hmm. For now, we're not going to worry about it too much. Uh, Mordekaiser, Darkstar Vanguard, not bad. I'm gonna try to group these guys up a little bit better. I only need two to get battle cast. Hmm. I do have some battle cast. Just a fake Ziggs. Mordekaiser, say up. We'll keep all these people just to see, because maybe... And look at Poppy. She's just still alive. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, our Rebel Synergy, I think, pulled us through. And there's Poppy. There's Graves, two stars. Okay. Uh, we could level up. Do I want to do that? Kinda. Okay. Move over here. And then I do, I think, want to make the Spear of Shojin. Uh, magic resist, we could put on him. Battlecast Infiltrator, Stark Guardian. Once again, Poppy's a pretty good tank. And then we do have Mordekaiser as another person. Let's hold on to everybody for now, maybe. Hmm. We'll pick her up now. Okay. Ziggs, you go over here. You over here, you. No idea. No idea, no idea. But yeah, I like having the guys I'm going to sell potentially closer to the shop. 
Yep. And we do have our Negatron cloak still. I would like another pirate. Pirate. Star Guardian Sorcerer. That has potential. Let's get rid of you and you. And then we'll pick up both of you. Dark Star. Nah. In Star Guardians, I think you need three. Yeah, to get more mana. Okay. So you kind of want to go Sorcerer Star Guardian, as far as I can tell. So Ari is great for that. Okay. Graves has taken damage. And he down. They got three two star characters, or three level twos. We're not going to win. And is that. Kaylin. Yep. Okay. Yep. We took damage. But in this game, you may want to take damage, so then you can be closer to choosing something earlier. Ooh, Master Yi. I think we'll take Master Yi, if nobody else does. Yeah, and the color of the circles lets you know which tier of character that is. So we can take Ari or Master Yi. Ah, okay. So we'll go for Ari, and she'll become like a level 2-ish. Okay, good. Didn't take... So now I can hang out over here, not block anybody. If I wanted to, I could be kind of a jerk and just run around and block people from seeing stuff. But no, we're not going to do that. The only problem I have with this is that this Ari has a chain metal vest thing. And really, she probably doesn't need that. Got that. Got Malphite. Um, ooh. Zed is a rebel infiltrator, didn't realize that. Um, and then we've got Ari. Do I have the money to level up? No. Not unless I sell something. Let's sell our Battlecast Brawler. Put Ari out here. And then, yeah. We'll see how this goes. What would I get if I put this on Ari? A Sword Breaker. That's not bad. Hmm. I think I want to save it, though. Okay. Yeah, Malphite is tanky. There we go. Yeah. The Chainmail Vest and the other thing would probably be better on a tank. Hmm. Rebel, Rebel, Rebel. We could get in there start guarding. <laughs> Clearly we are not going with our team planner build right now. Oh, uh, you can lock things in. We do not want to do that right now. And I am low on the monies. And I would like another pirate to make more money. It would be great. Just an opinion, mind you. Okay, um... So we'd get plus 25 magic resistance on her, she'd get both those bonuses. And we'd be able to potentially disarm people from the back line. Yeah, I don't know. No idea if that's really good or not. I feel like it's kind of wasted on a backliner. So I'm just going to try to be patient with it. Alright. What do you do again? Hmm. It might not be bad. So yeah, we've got three Star Guardians. And they're all lower in the totem pole, so they should be easier to find here. Now let's get rid of Kogma. Shin is a Chrono. Okay, so we're going to go with Zoe. I think I'm going to get rid of Shin. For Malphite. Get rid of Twisted Fate as well, so then we have 10 at the end of this, so that we will get an extra gold. Okay, so we got some items we want. That's the creep wave down. Okay. I'm still kind of second. Once again, that can be bad earlier in the game, 
because that means you're less likely to be able to pick the stuff you want during the carousel phase. Okay, we can get two stars, Zed. Syndra is a star guardian sorcerer. Jace. I want that piracy. Uh, piracy. Man. I can't really fit him in very well. I'm gonna put you here. Hmm. Uh, I'm not gonna fit Jason yet. What if I do this? Swordbreaker. Guardian Angel. That should be good. Red buff. Let's do that. Okay, and then we have some stuff that we can play on, like Malphite. Or Graves. Or whoever. Okay. When you become Bloodthirster again. Dragon's Claw. Ooh. That seems pretty good. Okay. Maybe we'll put that on Malphite, since he's a rebel. And we're kind of going rebels for the long term. Chrono Blade Master again. Astro Sniper Teemo. No idea. Snipers are fun, though. You only need two of them. But Blade Masters. Oh, Cybernetic Blaster Lucian. Hmm. With honor. Take you for now. Or maybe I just save up the money? Hmm. Hard to say. Let's go with the money. Uh, let's put this on Malphite. Dragon's Claw. There you go. We'll see how it goes. As you can see, they're dealing a lot of damage to us. Yep. Hmm. 21. Kind of want to try out Teemo. What does Astro do? Ooh. So if we got three Astro champions, that'd be good. There's another Shin. Oh man. Okay then. Um, Teemo, though. He's a sniper. An Astro sniper. Hmm. So now I'm not going to worry about it. Because I do want to put Jason next. And I can put Graves over here if I want. To protect Ari a bit better. Okay. So far, so good. Looks like our team is hanging in there. Ari got pulled to the back by Blitzcrank, but that red buff seems to be keeping her alive. Until then. Okay, and there's the damage thing, so you can check who's doing a lot of damage, who do you want to upgrade, etc, etc. It's pretty nice. Okay. Who do we pick here? Soraka, I think, is a Star Guardian who heals. Uh, we're going to be, like, second to last, though. I could pick a Poppy. I don't see Jace. Is that Jace? No, that's Darius, right? Maybe I'll pick up Darius. Darius a Poppy. Mm, that's another Negatron Cloak. I don't really need a Negatron Cloak. Let's go with this guy. All right. And he took Zaya, I think, with the belt. And because we've got an extra dude, he'll show up on the field. And what is he? Darius? Yeah. So let's just level up. Uh, instead of Darius, do we want Darius? He is a Mana Reaver. Let's leave him by Ari. We'll put you over here. So now we've got our Space Pirate stuff. Uh, and I think I'll put you on Zed. He's our infiltrator. There's another Graves. And another Shin again. <laughs> Man. Maybe I get rid of Timo. Goodbye, Timo. I'll take Graves. Maybe we can get him to three stars. That'd be pretty good. Okay, and as you can see, this tank has a lot going for it. Okay. 
but hopefully we'll just uh, outclass them with numbers. But doesn't look like it because those items are doing quite a bit of work. Windsuit's Rage Blade, Warmog's Armor. Yep, so they stacked their tank. Oh man. Close. Our special abilities pulled it out. Ziggs and Ari. Okay. Refresh costs nothing right now, so we will do that. Oh, Jace and Zoe. And Shock Zed. Zed. Hmm. Okay. Do I get rid of something? We haven't seen Yasuo for a while. Um. Hmm. Let's get rid of Malphite for now. Get another Zale. I probably should have gotten rid of Yasuo. I'm still hoping I can get full Rebels or something. We only need three more to get that super bonus. But, oh, they have a tier three Leona. Dang. Yep. Okay, then. Well, that happened. Hum. I would like to get a third Jace. I do still have the most health out of everybody right now. 85. So that's not bad. Hmm. Master Yi. Okay, we are going to sell Yasuo. For Master Yi. I might sell this Zed. Let's refresh first. And now we get Yasuo. Okay. I'll sell this Zed for Jinx. There's another Graves. Sell Ziggs for Graves. And we'll go pick up our items. Yoink. So we got a bunch of gold out of that. That's good. That means we can start doing more crazy stuff. Okay, so we've got Master Yi again. Put Ziggs over here. Start going towards a level. Put Darius... Uh, let's replace Darius with this guy for now. Even though that does decrease our money coming in for now. That's okay. So Wukong is a Chrono Vanguard. Pretty decent as far as I know. Could go Blade Masters with Ribbon. Hmm. For now, though, I don't think we would. We didn't get all the Space Pirates that we wanted. We were definitely getting more Rebels and stuff. Oh yeah. It's not going great at the moment, so I think we'll start working towards leveling and stuff. Okay, Astro Mystic. Don't care about any of those. Star Guardian Mystic. So Soraka would heal people. That's not terrible. I think we do this. And we can go with her in there. Then we got sorcerer combos. Okay. It's an idea. I would like another star pirate out there. Oh don't worry. So let's see how this goes. The Zig's not today. Hmm. Yeah, and that's why Ari is pretty good. All that damage. Until that happened. Okay. That is a fun dance by uh, Twisted Fate. Oh dear. Alright. Uh, finally we get another Graves. We get Jace. So I'll put Jace out there instead of somebody. Who? Or do I level? Hmm. Let's try to pull back all of our rebels and our sorcerers. Okay, and I would like to put Jace out next. 
It would be better to have him early, I think. I'll check who's doing the most damage and stuff, and maybe I'll get rid of Zed. He is helpful, because he's going to the back line, taking out the sorcerers and drawing their attention. Hmm. Yeah, there Ari took out mine before the end. Okay, and I am third. Um, who do I want here? I really don't know. Is that Jinx? I think that is Jinx, so I think I want Jinx, if possible. Hoping she won't get taken. She's got a rod. That helps with ability power. Uh, we're gonna go this way. Try to thread the needle. There we go. I'm gonna stay out of the way. Alright. So Jinx would be good, and so would our star pirate Jace. Hmm. Hmm. I think we'll go Jace next, though. Okay. Mech pilot. Infiltrator. Hmm. Irelia. She's a Mana Reaver Blade Master. Okay, we're gonna work towards level 8. Um, who's doing my damage? Not Zed, right? We'll replace Zed. Okay. We'll try something like this. Okay, well hopefully this will work. I don't think we're winning this one. They have a lot of snipers. Yep. Ash, Caitlyn, and Vayne. Yep. And we didn't have Zed to go attack him. Tsk, tsk. Okay, then. Hmm. I don't think we got any space pirate money, either. A space pirate money! Okay. So maybe we get rid of Jace. Maybe we don't get rid of Jace. Uh, there's a Zoe. Hi, Zoe. What's your name? Hmm. So Zed, Zed, Zed. And we replace you, Sorceress. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think our lack of attacking items are really hurting us too. Oh, I got one gold. Okay. Yeah, it looks like our space pirate bonus isn't really going for us. We don't have another vanguard right now. But Poppy would be a good vanguard. But I'm not getting many poppies. You know what? I got a Poppy. Get Wukong. Oh yes, sorcerer. Nico, Nico. Let's get ready to level. And this is just a creep round, so I'm not too worried about it. Okay. And let's see. It looks like we're doing okay. Oh, good. We got attack speed, right? That'd be good for Zed. Oh, that'd be kind of hmm. When they die, they get a new copy. Or a construct, I should say. Hmm. Okay. There's Teemo again. There's Ezreal, a Chrono Blaster. Hmm. I think we'd rather have Ezreal. No turning back now. Name. No. Chrono Vanguard. Okay. Well, let's level. And then we'll put out you, I think. Or are you? You. Okay. 
So we have five out of six rebels. Let's give Quincy's Rage Blade to her. Uh, look at this Malphite. He's a tank. Okay. Yeah, and my placement of my characters wasn't great there. Jinx is doing the most damage, though. Hmm. So I want her more protective than that, for sure. And then did I ever pick up Wukong? Probably not. Okay, there's Jace. Yet again. We could get Poppy. There's Darius. You know what? Selling Darius. Moving Master E up here. Mm. Red buff. Why not? Poppy. Refresh for zero. Um, we did have Riven at once. Point, right? No, Irelia. Okay. No other Irelias yet. Hmm. Well, this is not great. This looks like the beginning of the end. Okay. At least we didn't finish in last place, right? Hmm. Might be time to look for something else. Hmm. I have one more rebel, that'd be nice. Star Guardian Paragon. No idea how good that is. I assume it's great. I'm gonna get it. Uh, Astro Brawler. We haven't gotten a lot of Astros. Let's just level up. Okay. Alright, so stuff is working again, but basically, if you click keep watching, you are stuck watching the game forever unless you just exit uh, the app entirely. So I don't know if you get credit for stuff if you do that, so I would recommend clicking exit now. Uh, if you do want to see strategies that people are doing and learn how they're doing things, then that's a good idea. But yeah, we did six, so that's not terrible as far as I can tell. Uh, we did get a rally insult at the end there, sorry I couldn't really commentate. Well, yeah, yeah, we got six rebels, and as you saw, we got destroyed by snipers. So, looks like snipers is the new meta, maybe? I don't know. I really don't know. Plus, the guy in second has 
four three-star characters, which is pretty insane. So that worked very well for them. Oh yeah. We played a match, we get some XP. And there we go. And there are limits on the missions in terms of how much time you have to finish them. So yeah. Thanks for watching, dear viewer. Leave a like if you've enjoyed Teamfight Tactics. Subscribe to see more iOS gaming videos. Comment below on what you think would be a winning strategy in Teamfight Tactics. Have a great day, dear viewer.